All right, for this lesson, we will be discussing our problems that involve e probability. In other words, we are applying probability to our fundamental counting principles. Your rule one, two, three, four. Check out the description box for our lessons. Now, now I'll also leave a link to e loganji e lesson ka grade ten on the basics of e probability because lana. These problems, since I involve a e probability, you also need to understand e logange, e probability formula. This is the formula. I'll just uh, give a quick recap. I, I'm, I'm not going to do a full lesson on e basics of a e probability because there's already a lesson. Yaga grade ten. Check it out. So share e link in the description box. Okay, this is the formula for a e probability. The probability. I think it's a so the probability for any event let's say e it's the event so the probability for event e is equal to the number of outcomes in event e divided by the number of outcomes in the, the sample space or the total number of outcomes if our funoguti sample space ne? so this is the formula for a probability all right I think it's so this is the formula for e probability the probability of event e is equal to the number of outcomes in e event e divided by the number of outcomes in the sample space this is the probability formula so now we are applying a probability to counting principles for example now example of talala so consider the letters of the word night. If the letters are arranged in any order without repetition to form different words, right? So we are forming different word arrangements without repeating them. What is the probability that the word formed will a is about in probability? What is the probability that the word formed will start with K and end with K? I mean, will start with K and end with T. I think it's a solar block number one. I think I my letters one, two, three, four, I six. Six letters. So each block it represents a block where it is a letter. Four. Five, then six, then six. For the first letter, it's K. For the last one, Ubani, or T. How many are we left with? F four. O N, O I, O G, Ubani, O H. Now, Sfunoko has you what is the probability of getting a word that starts with K and ends with T, right? So, we need to apply a counting principle. Which one? Because about rule number two. We are not repeating any any letters. So, for the first block, I have how number choice is sign guy. Um, I send this so. Let. Okay, let's just say. Some let E. B the event let e be the event right so the number of outcomes for event e where the the word starts with k and ends with t is about equal to it's not like e lo the event always commonly name e it can be a b c or e or d it's up to you when i so the number of L the number of outcomes in event E. See apply our rule number two for the word that starts with K and ends with T. So for the first block, how many choices do I have? How many letters do I have to choose from? Four. So it's four times for this block it's three choices. For this one it's two. For this one, it's one. So, in other words, it's four factorial, which is equal to 
4 shift fact is equal to 24 is equal to 24 then this is a calculator what the sample space here dealing a event the other outcomes of e, of event e now let us calculate the sample space so for the sample space for the sample space it's equal to it's equal to so the sample space it's all the letters you get much right it's all the letters it's all the letters in teen again and it's all the letters in kazuguti the sample space is represent all 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 the word arrangements even including the case where the word starts with k and ends with t even lamanya magama or the word arrangements where the word does not start with k maybe starting or n i g or t or h right so it's all the word arrangements that's our sample space all the word arrangements so it's what it's six factorial right it's six factorial you about six factorial what about the word night has one two has six letters no more i pala so six times five times four times three times two times one is equal to six six shift a man six effect victoria 720 so 720 now therefore the probability of event e taking place is 24 over 720 divided by 720 is equal to uh -uh, 24 divided by 720 equal to it's 1 over 30 it's 1 over 30 now I answer it together now for b for b yeah ne palanga makapatle la la and let's see all right some of shrink at this thing so una so some we shrink like that sharp all right again b let's do b the word starts with the letter n gemanj right it starts with the letter n i think reuse it let's sketch this okay now this example but he, the word starts with n how many choices okay babe. if the word starts with n this word arrangement starts with n i'm only left with okay i with g u h u b a n i u t so for this one let's call this event b number of event uh, number of outcomes in event b is over equal to now the word starts with letter n for this block how many choices do i have i have five for this one in a four for this one in a three for this one in a two for this one in a one so it means that it's five factorial for this one answer lana ubani shift okay five fact equal to 120 divided by the sample space i change it, it's still six over my letters and i got six for this word so answer it to the probability of this happening starting with the letter n is equal to 120 divided by the 720 so 120 divided by 720 is equal to 1 over 6 answer it's 1 over six now you answer it okay right example number two so now example number two game but a combination to a lock is formed using three letters of the alphabet excluding o q s u v and bunny and w 
and using three digits. The numbers and letters can be repeated. Calculate the probability that a combination chosen at random A starts with the letter X and ends with the number 9. Pegagula. Pegagula. The first thing, come let's see, understand, Uguti. Um, I'm alphabets going to guy, 26 in total. We have 26 alphabets. But, nothing it, let's say remaining alphabets. Remaining alphabets. After excluding O, Q, S, U, V, and W. Remaining letters. Or alphabets. So, this is a T, 26. Ah, man. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So I'm excluding 6 letters. It means that the remaining letters are in I20. So, now T, you can use any digits. Use any 3 digits for the letters. It means that I'm a digits warm now. Digits, digits, digits. Now I'm a digits. It's 0. 0 is a digit. 1, 2, three four five six seven all the way up to nine i'm a digit to it at zero zero appellate log bunny good nine so in total i have ten digits ne? i thought i should start off my logo card right just to clarify logo card so our lock combination is over now three letters and three digits so it's all around my letters are three now my letters are three. If we, it's in a Now my digits are in a key. three. All right. It means that the combination of some something about a, we have b, we f. Then our digits are three. Something about zero. We have seven. We have nine. Right. I'm just making up a look at combination. I'm just making an example. All right. Okay. Now, but to calculate the probability that this combination chosen at random, right? I saw my name, my combinations, right? My name, all my combinations. So, for not a combination, what is the probability that the combination chosen at random starts with the letter X and ends with the number bunny 6, right? So, I think erase la. Erase la so that Lana Siva no X, then La Pasiva no Bani no six. Then La Pasiva no Bani no six. Right? So no calculator the probability. So A let's call this let um let maybe B B the event. You need to define your event together. Let B be the event, right? Let B be the event. So the number of outcomes of B, of event B is equal to, so apply rule number one, yes? So apply rule, okay, actually it's not a rule, but so apply the, the exponential no notation, ngoba. Is about a combination to a lock formed using three letters excluding blah 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 and any three digits. The na the numbers and letters can be repeated. Yeah, what can be repeated? So this apply any exponential notation since they can be repeated. So Lana for the alphabets and like a stalella. How many choices do I have for this first block? I only have one choice. Ngoba, X. So that's why I only have one choice for the first block, which is X multiplied by. For the second block, how many choices do I have? You know how many choices? All right. <coughs> so, Lana, there's only one choice, which is X. So, for the second block, you have about 20. It means na lang nga fagao x ang isong oba they can be repeated. I can have x x x or 
B, B, they can be repeated. So, ngoba ama letters, I only have 20 choices. Ang so ngoba ksele ama letters I I 20. I can choose from 20 letters. So, that's why I have 20 choices. For the third block, the alphabet, I have another 20 choices. I have another 20 choice. Multiplied by for ama logange ama digits how many choices do i have for this square i have 10 times for this one i have 10 for this one how ma how many choices do i have i only have one choice which is 6 kwamelengenu 6 lapha according to this one so this is the sample space as you calculate value are called as one it's one okay 2 times 2 that's 4 4 4 and then zero zero it's forty thousand but as we show times ten times ten answer at forty thousand forty thousand i'm finding correct the lapa guma guma comments yeah yeah four thousand so i just what i just needed to be sure now as calculated the sample space again man the sample space is equal to all the possible outcomes it's all the possible outcomes right even the case where the first letter it's not x and then the la the last digit la it's not six so we include everything so the sample space is about 20 times 20 times 20 la 20 choices 20 cho choices 20 choices times 10 choices time 10 choices for the digits and 10 la pick clean in for the choices mobile i'm including everything go sample space 2 times 2 times 2 isn't it 60 uh -uh, man. 2 times 2 that's 4 it's 8 so go about 8 1 2 1 2 3 go about 800,000 but that's special times 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 10 times 10 times 10 a 8 million they are not 800 yeah 1 2 3 4 yeah it's 8 million so it's 1 2 3 1 2 3 and shall okay so the probability of event b taking place it's 40 1 2 3 divided by 8 million 1 2 3 4 5 6 equal to so answer level zero bar cancel low cancel a low yaksala four over eight hundred which is which is one and then lana it's two so it's one over two hundred one over two hundred now I send the OB let us do OB can send OB or at the end the so let me shrink this one as well what about the waiting on the information the waiting on the information okay i hope is abonagana after doing this that is susan is a la maybe not doesn't work i think is enough space get fun so unsafunale information le. All right, B. Hmm. Okay, B. B has only one X this time. We only have one X. Only one X. All right, for this one. Ah, wa. Ah, wa. No, 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 no. So this one was often again the so. Let us erase log and do OP and do OP. The space is not cool for what I'm about to do. All right, B. Now OP. All right, B has only one X, so let this 
event b a as if it's a a right ah uh, okay i should have made o a a then o b u b then guys o c o c but anyway it doesn't matter let this event be a so the number of outcomes in a as over equal to all right so let's say for example since are the first block who x so i only have one choice for the first block so it's one times has exactly one x you cannot repeat together this time has exactly one x yeah what exactly one x meaning you cannot repeat o x so now after making this square o x i only have 19 choices for the letters times 19 for this block times 10 times 10 times 10 right for the digits for one two three squares see i will say i add the foot to move x and again allah or and gonna be la so if we x guy on again on our parking man it's going to be 19 lana 19 choices lana i only have one choice which will x not about 19 times 10 10 10 so it's 10 10 10 plus open bracket if we x again again on our parking manager line you're gonna 19 19 choices 19 19 times 1 plus 19 times 10 times 10 times 10 so Therefore, the answer here is about 19 times 19 times 10 times 10 times 10 times 10 times 10. Hmm. Oh, okay. I think it is times 3. What was your final lesson to anyway? So it's 1,083,000. 1 million. 83, Eighty-three thousand. Now I answer it to you. One So this is the number of outcomes for A. So for the sample space, is a fun enough before it's eight million. Eight million. So the probability of event A have um the probability of event A occurring it's this divided by 8 million divided by 8 million so that divided by 8 million is equal to oh, uh, cancel cancel it's 1083 divided by 8000 and I answer it again yes so far so good I hope C has only one or more number six in it i think erase this so that we can do c much all right for c this question it's a little bit tricky but you know it's simple it's simple it's simple it just needs you to understand the question much better to understand good bafuna understand good bafuna in so i think susela susela so this time it's only one six has only one or more six in it the combination is only one or more six in it now from our um, probability laws let's call this event let c be the event taking place right so the probability of c taking place is equal to one minus the probability of not c happening this is a probability law from grade 10 right check it out check it out check it out so lana let's apply probability law because in one another, this is the most easiest way around the problem Big argument. So we want the probability of not C. Hmm. Yeah, the probability of not C. 
happening. But first, this is what thing are in the number of outcomes where not C is happening equal to. So for this combination where not C is happening, where one or more six is not present. In other words, I'm saying let's calculate the probability where U6 are exist equal, right? In order for we to calculate the probability of one or more six in it, it's either we do this. See calculator, you're not directly, or see calculator the instance where U C are exist equal so that we can calculate the probability of C. So the, the number of outcomes in not C happening, it's this one. The combination here to la for the alphabets or the letters was about 20 times 20 uh, times 20. I have 20 options, 20 options, 20 options times if for 6 again or not 6, 6 is not present. It means that you have no 9 la times 9 times 9 with 6 are here okay man with 6 are in fagila right now it's not c not c so this is equal to yeah you can see value times 20 times 20 times 9 times 9 times 9 5 million 820 okay 5 million 832 1 2 3 so this is the event or the case where not C is, is taking place. The number of outcomes within the sample space, probability is number of outcomes divided by the number of, of the total number in the sample space of our outcomes is equal to I change it's still 8 million. Still 8 million. Now 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Again, it's 20 times 20 times 20 times 10 times 10 times 10. That's the sample space. It's all of the different combinations. So lana zoba equal to 1 minus the probability of not C happening. It's not C divided by the sample space, which is 5, 8, 3, 2. 1, 2, 3 divided by 8 million. The cancel cast one egg man. one minus five eight three two divided by eight million eh? eight thousand eight thousand. So this is our answer. Now I answer you to two seven one. 271 divided by 1000 divided by 1000 now you answer it so okay this question is a little bit tricky but go through it over and over again we won't get the our understand the explanation yam explanation yam regarding the question this is the best explanation is an eye but if we are well back to the, the lesson on our probability laws, which by the way, so share a link in the description box. Maybe I understand that better this thing. Now for now guys, as one and on the next lesson, I hope we enjoy it. I hope you tell us some value, you like, share, and subscribe. So for now, as one and on the next lesson. Bye bye.